Yeah, the U Crops Monument Avenue 10K returned to the city today, all its pre-pandemic glory. This was the 23rd year. Over 17,000 runners hit the streets of Richmond for the race. Community partners and hundreds of volunteers, they all played a really big part in making this event a success. And some of your favorite CBS Sixers, we cheered on runners over at the CBS Six cheer station. We were at the corner of Monument and Tilden. Some familiar faces, including Julie Bragg, Leland Pender, Bill Fitzgerald, Candace Burns, Reba Hollingsworth, and Rob Cardwell. They all joined in on the fun, keeping runners motivated. Storm Rider was also there in the middle of the festivities. And right there in the middle of the action, too, was at the finish line was our own Maggie Marshall. She spoke with just a few of the runners and shares with us their stories of success and celebration, plus how this year's race brought in nearly a hundred grand for a big time need. It was a race filled with so much emotion. I saw tears, cheers, and everything in between. Runners set, go! All right, thank you, Lori. From the start of Ucrup's Monument 10K <laughs> to the finish, there is one thing all runners felt throughout. All five K down, all five K back, people cheering. It was just a great energy. It was electric. I, I can't even put it in the words. The energy is incredible. It gets you to the finish line. Sports backers says roughly 18,000 people came out to race. And to think it's been three years since we've been out here in person is just hard to fathom. It is so fantastic. The weather is perfect. The crowds, the, it's just, it's a wonderful day for Richmond, and it's just great to be back together again. Some folks came in costume, conquered a milestone. I did it. You did it? Yes. Or were running for a cause. But the cause has been outstanding. Dr. Robert Wynn is the director of the VCU Massey Cancer Center. His center is the official charitable partner for the race. Seeing these folks at the finish line just gets me jazzed. Every single dollar, every single cent goes into improving the knowledge of how we can cure cancer. As of Saturday afternoon, the organization had raised over $90,000 from the event. It's running as one team, one fight against cancer. At this race, it's a celebration of wins and people's wise. It's, just, it's the best day of the year. You sit here and you see people coming across the finish line, people who have never thought they could do this, have never run this far in their lives, are overcoming cancer, some other type of injury. Just some emotional, you see the emotional outburst at the finish line, and it's just incredible to sit here. It gives me goosebumps even to talk about it. In Richmond, Maggie awesome. Marshall, CBS 6 News. Oh, and hey, we had a shout-out camera out there. If you gave a shout-out to someone special during the race, you can head over to our website, WTVR.com, and you can see your video.